Hey guys, it's Caitlin. This week's theme on SJG is once again mixed bunch. So I got the theme makeup and hair tutorial for a meet. So for me, I always like to do my hair all cool and fancy, but I don't do a lot of makeup, but I'm still going to show you guys a simple little eyeshadow and stuff that really can go with any leotard, like whatever color your team leotard is. And yeah, so uh, let's go. First, we're going to start off with makeup. So I always like to moisturize my face, and you can use whatever your favorite moisturizer is. So just make sure you get everywhere. Then I'm taking this blush and just putting it on the apples of my cheeks. I'm going to take this palette and this bright white, which is a little bit sparkly, I'm just going to put it all over my eyelid. Then I'm going to take the lightest color blue and just put it on the like tip of my eyelashes and then blend it in a little bit because blue is one of my team colors. I'm gonna take this blue eyeliner and put a little bit on the end of my eyelid and put a little wing for extra effect. <laughs> this is the finished eyeshadow. But we're not done with eyes. I'm going to take my mascara and I just took my favorite mascara. I'm putting it on the top and bottom lashes. So this is the complete eye makeup. And I'm taking one of my favorite lip glosses and just putting it all on my lips. So now that we're finished with makeup, it's time to move on to hair. Let's go. So of course we want to brush our hair before starting. I'm also adding a little bit of water because normally at meets I'll take a shower before I do my hair, but since I didn't take a shower, we're just going to wet it and spray it with a little bit of water. My mom is doing my hair and this design is called a spider web. So what you're gonna do first is separate your hair into four sections and tie it off with a, an elastic band. So you should be parting your hair and tying it off in four equal sections. Make sure it's on the top half of your hair. This is what it should look like. Then you're going to take the first two um, tied off pieces and then a little extra hair from the side and you're going to tie that off. You're just going to do the same thing on the other side. Then you're going to grab a little bit more hair from the middle and you're going to tie that off by itself. As usual, you're going to do the same thing to the other side. This is what it should look like. Then you're going to take the first two pieces once again like we did the um, first time and you're going to tie that all off. Make sure there's a lot of hair left for the other side and a little bit in the middle.
And of course, you're gonna do the same thing to the other side. This should leave you with three equal pieces of hair. Two are gonna be tied off and one is just gonna be loose in the middle. Then from here, you can really do whatever you want. You can put it in a ponytail, you can put it in a bun, but what we did was just braid it. Also with the spider web, you can make it as intricate and fancy and designy as possible. There's so many different things you can do with the spider web. This is just one of the simpler designs. Also, I have so many different ribbons, and this is one of my favorites. It just has my team colors on it, and we're tying that at the top of the ponytail. I'm sorry, the braid. all the makeup and my hair done and I think it looks really good but remember that you can always do different variations there's so many things you can do with the spider web and of course whatever your team colors are like my team colors are blue and purple and black so that's why I also did the blue on my eyelids but remember that whatever your team color is you can do that one so I hope you guys enjoyed my video this week. You can see me every Friday on SGG. Bye! See you next Friday!